Hi everybody, I'm Jeff from Missouri Wind and Solar and I want to show you a cool uh, product that I came across. It's the Ames Micro Grid Tie Inverter and this is, an M uh, this is a 250 watt model. Now that's all I have right now is 250 watts. This has MPPT, it's UL approved. It's DC input from the solar panel using the two MC4 connectors and 220 volts AC output and it comes with a 19 foot cord. This thing has a 15 year warranty on it with an optional 20 25 year warranty. 20 to 25 year warranty. Um, giving you an up close of the uh, specs on this. So this is UL approved. That's that's the good thing. Now the solar panels uh, that are recommended to use with this are 200 to 310 watt panel, 27 to 48 volts. The operating range is 16 to 60 volts. It has an efficiency of 96.5% efficient, which is really good. And this is very easy to install. And I'll show you how to do it. What I'm demonstrating here with is a Renogy 250 watt solar panel. This is 37 volt output, 8 amps. Well this is how easy this uh, inverter hooks up. Pretty much, you just take yourself some sheet metal screws and shoot them in to the mounting bracket or some bolts, you can put some bolts in. There are some holes in these panels, you can put a bolt in. Then you simply just take the MC4 connectors, plug your panel right into it, and then you plug in the 19 foot cord that comes with this. There's only one way it can lock in, and you wire it into a 220 amp circuit breaker. It's that easy. Flip the breaker, and you'll see the green light start flashing. And when the green light is flashing, that means it's putting out power. It's that easy. So, if you want to know how much power these things are putting out, if you really want to see, um, there's something you can do. You can buy a meter for that. And I'll show you that meter in a minute. Now, there's another way you can do this also. These, are, by the way, these are very heavy, good, heavy construction and the warranty is just excellent on them. And this is what we have on our solar tracker out front um, with 3,000 watts. So here's the end of the cord that it comes with. You got a hot, hot, neutral, and ground. Now you could wire this up into a dryer outlet or an air conditioning outlet. You could put a cord in on this, say an air conditioning outlet or a uh, cord end and plug it into an air conditioning outlet to feed your grid. That'll work. I'll show you the uh, meter so you can see what you're getting. So if you'll see the little bars going back and forth, the faster those bars are moving, that means the more power you're putting in, say like at noon or something, that's putting out a full 3,000 watts. And this has battery backup. So if you unplug this meter, it'll hold its memory. Uh, it's got a battery built on the inside. This is very easy to install. There's two uh, plugs down here, two at the top uh, for your wire to go in and just back out of. And that's all this meter does and they're around 30 bucks. Real easy. And that way you would know uh, what your solar panel is actually producing. 